All right, as some of you uh, may or may not know, um, once upon a time, when I still lived in the city and I had consistency in pallets, there was a uh, mattress shipping place um, on the end of the block that I lived on. And uh, they had pallets that were made out of this. That is a, that is a bench that I made uh, out of a pallet I found on the side of the road. I actually found several of them. I've made uh, four of these benches in total, and it's not a matter of uh, being able to find the 2x4 wood that comes with that pallet. You know, you can just go buy a 2x4 even though they're, they used to be uh, $2.88 a piece, and I used to feel bad buying 2x4s uh, at that price. Now they're about $14. Um, but for whatever reason, I can't find anybody to come buy any of my trees that are large enough to saw or come and saw them into boards for me. But anyway, it's those flat deck portions on the, the uh, seat in the back itself that I have the issue that I, I haven't been able to find uh, since the beginning of COVID when nothing was selling. Uh, these boards here, that uh, you know, they're just a rough cut, but they sand up nice. But today what I'm going to be doing, if you look up here, this is all kind of, that was from the, some of you might know, uh, bitch kitty that we had. She was our kitty for a lot of years that she uh, passed on to the litter box in the sky at some point uh, in the last few months over the winter now that it's, well, it's May now. She's been gone since before Christmas. But anyway, uh, I'm going to go over this because I built this probably, well, let me think about this. We've been up here in the woods for a year and uh, COVID's been two years. I was in that house for two years. I might have built it. This is the first one that I built here, and I may have actually built this one about five years ago. Um, anyway, I'm going to... Oh, hello, kitty. We still don't have a name for this little cat yet. He's cute as can be. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, hit this with the sander, to which this is going to be... Uh, I've been cordless with my tools for quite some time now, and... Uh, to go back to a sander with a cord is going to be kind of a pain in my butt, but I'm going to switch cameras from this one over to a, uh, a time lapse to sand this down, and then I'm going to put some uh, water sealant on it. I don't know that I'm going to stain it because I, I kind of like how it is. I just I want to put some water sealant on it to uh, protect it. Um, yeah, here we go with that. All right, so it's as if magic. Four hours has passed by. Yeah, I got distracted. I only did one pass on that. I'm going to have to set the time lapse back up to do another pass uh, at a different speed because it literally gave me four seconds for about 10 minutes worth of sanding. Um, I'm going to move that thing into the shade, but let me take you out front and show you what I got distracted by that I got for free. All right, so what is it, you might ask? Well, one is still assembled. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, that's going to be a full eight feet. And then I got the tracks here for uh, all of those. Um, I got all this for free, and this is going to be enough um, to do both sides of my porch on either side of the uh, steps there, to which I already have the, the steps and everything drawn up. It's a matter of committing to the $300 worth of material. I've been hoping that something would pop up to redo the stairs themselves, but that's going to give me a nice little, uh, yeah, that's going to do the whole porch. I'm, uh, I'm excited about that. But got to get back to the project at hand first this will probably end up being in another video um, yeah that was free ignore all the rocks in my truck that, that's what happens when you buy firewood and they put it in there with a uh, uh, with a tractor you get rocks yeah I got that for free so back to my bench all right so my next uh, order of duty here so I'm gonna wipe all the dust off of it Wood is still not the uh, smoothest in the world, but it's good for sitting on. As you can see, boy, oh boy, this towel that I'm using, this rag I should say that I'm using, this is part of a, a pillowcase that my, or, or excuse me, a flat sheet that my wife made curtains out of last year. I mean, you can see the dust comes off. It ain't got to be perfect because it's outdoors. You know, birds are going to shoot on it. The usual. But the water sealer that I've got, um, I would almost put money on. You could probably get it cheaper wherever it is you live. As, uh, the hardware store in this town is uh, limited on its uh, supply of things. Its prices are a little high. Um, and I mean no disrespect in that. Because, uh, well, you know, like our prices drive to the next one. It's 40 miles away. <laughs> well, the next hardware store is... 
uh, I don't know, 30 miles, give or take, and the prices are exactly the same. So, I mean, like, you're, we're 80 or 100 miles from the nearest uh, Lowe's around these parts. But this is just some magic water sealer that I bought last year. It's got chunks in it, you know, it's $14.99. It's probably 30 bucks this year. But this stuff is uh, water cleanup. You just, uh, I'm going to end up putting two applications on this, but you literally just wipe it on there. There's nothing to it. And if you get it all over the place, oh well. Best part about this stuff is there's no real stink of uh, chemical with it. Doesn't smell like anything. Uh, if you leak it on your grass underneath, it's not going to kill your grass. I wouldn't recommend eating it, but uh, I'd imagine that if somehow you ended up ingesting this stuff, um, I don't think you would die. Don't quote me on that, though. I'm definitely not a uh, an attorney. <laughs> Just a guy who makes benches out of pallets and feeds goats and cats. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and shut the video off here and uh, go around the rest of all of this. And uh, be done with that. I'm going to check back with you uh, when it's dry and about you know, as breezy as it is today. And it is, let me look at the thermometer. It is 90 degrees outside in the shade. Um, as breezy as it is out here today, I would bet, to, I, I would be willing to bet this stuff will be dry in less than 20 minutes and uh, ready for a second application if you so choose. I uh, probably just going to end up with one because this is on the porch and this is literally just to keep uh, people spill sodas or beers or whatever. Uh, it just beads up. And, uh, doesn't allow it to soak in and it helps the uh, be less of a mess. Um, if this were something that we're going to sit out in the actual weather um, be another story but for this particular application this stuff works mint all right I'll check back with you guys in a little bit You'll see I got this other bench here that needs uh, the same treatment. And I'll show you this one, the one on the front porch. It's exactly the same, but it's literally exactly the same. So it's been uh, as long as it took to uh, rinse out the brush. And it's uh, just about dry. Give or take. But you can see the drastic difference between the two. They were both the same shade when I started. All right. So it is completely dry now. <clears throat> it's considerably better than it did lost uh, the middle of my day otherwise I'd have gotten more accomplished today I'm uh, waiting on my wife to get home now so we can uh, figure out what we're doing for dinner um, well I'm not waiting on her to get home to uh, I'm waiting on her to get home to decide what I'm cooking uh, I don't I don't make her cook I do all the cooking anyway turns out neither of the uh, time-lapse videos of sanding worked out I need to it was something that I used to do on my old device I haven't been able to figure out on this one I can't get it to Bluetooth the files bloody daddy daddy da you know, technology issues. I'll figure it out, though, going forward from here. But uh, I'll check back with you guys when I uh, I know what's going on with uh, the uh, railing for the front porch. i got to do some measuring and staring at and thinking with that. But I'll get to it. Oh, I hear a little kitty that's... <laughs> it was just falling off of the... You can see, now on this, you can see the drastic difference in color between. It was falling off the edge of the slab there 
So that's it for now. I'll uh, let me get this one uh, uploaded. Talk to you soon.